In part 15, I was working on a tale, so let's continue. Okay, so, I was going to send with a tip, and then I decided to just wait and took him back. But now I'm back in, I'm actually going to do this. Well, not that though. Here, I'll just do this though. I'll just go over to the and then delete this. And now we have this. Now, remember the fingers and toes where I had the hexagon as one base? Well, I'm not going to here because at this point it gets a bit kind of weird. Yeah, see? Oh, let me smooth chain. Yeah, you see? It looks weird because of all this. Like, I'm not going to see it though, but. Yeah, you can see this kind of thing going on. With the fingers, you actually don't see that. In fact, I can go to here. Um, that's not going to work. Okay, here we go. So, you see that with the hexagon faces? You actually have... It got a little bit pinched in the middle though. But, it's not terrible or anything. In fact, it kind of looks kind of cool though. And... It's to provide symmetry and makes the thing a lot easier around. And of course, the tail is the same way too. But when you go to the inner tail with the dodecagon face, yeah, that doesn't look very nice. So, here's how I fix that. And if I don't click the wrong thing, that is. So, I had to go back to edit mode and instead of one single face, a dodecagon's case, because it's 12 vertices and edges. All I need to do is this. I'm first going to go to training faces. Oh, no, no, that is incorrect. That gets a much worse result. Anyways, I meant to go to poke faces and <coughs> saw a congestion again. Now, of course, that looks even worse than before because you have too many trying to one vertex. But that's all I'm going to do here. And so I'm going to do this. I'm actually going to take these ones right here and just delete and dissolve edges and now it's a lot better except now it's flat so I would have to fix that and here's how I would do it if I don't do that okay so what I need to do is this take this vertex and Let's pull it out. So yeah, now it's a lot better. And of course, um, yeah, so remember how I said I made a video about why hex guns shouldn't be considered in gun exactly like octagons are higher? Well, here's one reason why, because the hex gun faces and the south surf you don't see any weirdness going on. But with the do dodecagon, you remember that it was, well, it was a bit too chaotic and didn't look very good. And so, with the six quads around the hexagon corner, it looks a lot better. So yeah, so let me just do this though, because the tail looking kind of not as good as I like. I think it's because it's too thin. So let's do this. And this too, and make this smaller, and then make this. Oh yeah, so I have to do this for this part. Make this smaller. In fact, I'm just move. I'm just gonna move over here. Okay, I think that's too much. Uh. Anyways, let's just rotate this some. Um. Okay, so. I think I'll now finish the guy. So let's just do this. I'm gonna save first and then I continue later. Of course, before I continue, I need to do this. So um first of all, since the tail is kind of finalized now, I'm gonna do this. You know, just take these ones, delete them, and then oh, uh, I can't do that because of this. No, this one. And this too. And now I can just do this. So let me just 
gallery edit mode and then I'm going to turn on the mirror like this. So yeah, that's what it's looking like. Of course, now I need to do this. Okay, what do I need to do? Oh yeah, so this right here. Now, well, first of all, I don't want to do that. Let me try this. See, it looks kind of weird, so I want to fix that. Can this work? Um, yes. Except I need to turn clipping before I do such things. Okay, that's a little better. But I think it's too small. And, oops. Yeah, that's why I did that thing that looked kind of weird to start, because it does this if I do that. So, let's see if I can do this. Smooth. How's that? Whatever. I think it's fine. In fact, make it smaller again. No, no, I need to do this. Go over here. Ah, no. Let me do this though. Smaller. Okay, how's that? Okay. Um, yeah, I forgot. Ugh. I really do think that thing's a bug where when I use, like, well, I think I'll most show you though. Yeah, so it's really a bug that if I were to click on like this, it turns it off unless I have this turned off. It makes no sense, and I don't know why it's a problem here, but not in 2.79 or other bits I've used in the past. Anyway, it's not for me to complain about something that probably got fixed in the future. Let me just actually make this smaller. Nope. Because that's a bit big. Also, just two. Okay, so now I'm pretty much finished the guy. So I'm actually going to save this. And when I say finish the guy, I mean that I finished modeling him, but there's a few things I, there's a few things I need to do, because one, you know how the origin point is like right there? Well, I don't want to ride at the same where the original key was. I actually want to do this. So, go down to where the bottom feet are, like this. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'll do this one right here. And then shift S and then curse to selected. And then I can just deselect that. Actually, I want to put it there. Actually, no. I want to put it like. Let's say where he was, though. Yeah, put it there. Is that right? Oh, uh, except for one problem. So, yeah, so remember in that, like, I think like part one or three or something when I was doing the head or something else. So, yeah, so the three cursor is only on one foot. And yeah, it's the heel, but I want to be in between the two feet. So, all I have to do is go to three cursor location and then press zero and there you go. Now it's centered. And is that what I want? Here. Yeah. Okay, so now I can do this. And then set origin to three cursor. There. Now let me just put it back over here. Oh yeah, it's around as I when I was working the head, but now it's right there. Anyway, so actually I want to fix this back. It's kind of flat looking. Where is it? I don't know why I was selecting there, but okay. Okay, good. Yeah, trying to make it look as good as I can. And let's see. Oh, I think this is still too big. And that's too big too. Okay, so yeah. Now 
you're probably wondering if I can move up to the grid, like, you know, like do this. Well, not yet. I'll get to eventually. Anyways, so let's see. Yeah, that's, that's going to be it for part 16. So I'll be back. And when I come back, I'll probably do some adjustments before I'm done. So that's it. But first, I need to say this first. There.